It was just one interview, but it could change the Middle East. We'd come to film the Assads promoting their charity, but were told the Syrian president had something important to say. In an exclusive interview, Bashar al-Assad told Sky News he's ready to invite Barack Obama to a summit in Damascus. Uh, the United States has a uh, very special role as the greatest power. And uh, I think President Obama should visit as many countries as he can in order to make this dialogue and to learn about the reality more. And of course, that includes Syria. Would you like to take the opportunity, Mr. President, on Sky News to invite Barack Obama to come here? I will. <laughs> I will use your channel too, to do it. The invitation follows US Middle East envoy George Mitchell's visit to Damascus last month. After years of isolating Syria, the US has been trying to engage with it. Now Syria has responded. But how soon could we see the American president in Damascus? Uh, that depends on him. <laughs> as long as uh, you talk about the invitation, I will uh, ask you to uh, to convey the invitation to him. Of course, on Sky News, Mr. <laughs> President, we'll relay the invitation to Barack Obama to come here. And it would be good news for the region, do you think, in other ways? Could it see uh, more detente between Syria and Israel, for instance, indirect talks with Israel starting again? Uh, as principle, yes. But that depends on the principles of peace. The President's offer to America follows our interview with his wife. Asma al-Assad's the dynamic first lady of a country that's changing. She'd also suggested a meeting between the two leaders. The fact that um, President Obama is young, um, well, President Assad is also very young as well, so maybe it, it is time for these young new leaders uh, to make a difference in the world. Can you see yourself hosting Michelle Obama and her husband at the, one, one of the palaces here in the near future? I can see myself hosting them in Damascus, in the old town, meeting with people, getting a sense of how we live, who we are, and what Syria is about. We joined the First Lady promoting her greatest passion, a movement for Syria's youth, and watching some of them debating. Afterwards, we asked them about America's young president. Do you like Barack Obama? Um, yes. Would you like to see him come here? Oh, no. oh yes. It's time for us to change. It's time for us to open up to, to the whole world in order to, to, to let them see us uh, as, as the, the real us. It was almost a casual interview, but one with potentially historic implications. After years of hostility and frostiness, American-Syrian relations may now be heading towards detente. Dominic Waghorn, Sky News, in Damascus.